Adele's been in the news a hell of a lot lately. We yeah. obviously she's got a new single out and uh, and she's given loads of interviews. And one thing she said I found really a bit distressing. She said she ne she's talking about all the people she worked with on her album. Yeah. And she said she wished she'd never met her music idol Damon Albarn because he didn't live up to her expectations. Now, my first reaction was this is incredibly rude because you have worked with people, you could be a bit more respectful. Mm, yeah. But then I thought, how often do you ever meet someone you've really idolised and they actually don't, you know, live up to your expectations? And did you? Yeah, for me, it was Matt Damon. <gasps> no! Janet at a charity do when I'm running the auction, yeah. and I've already met George Clooney, who's fantastic. Hang so on, I'll just put high heels on. I'll just pick up that other name. <laughs> <laughs> so I've got the high heels on, and the hostess says to me, and now would you please meet Matt Damon? And I'm looking, and I'm looking, oh. and then I go, oh! <laughs> Identity. Yeah. He must have been standing on blocks or <laughs> all the female stars oh, were in a gutter. Janet, I love Matt Come Damon. On, Matt Janet, Did you actually ever yeah. say, why is he down there? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what? I'm sorry, that's very heightist. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's not right, is it, heightist? Just because uh, he's small. But have you met anyone famous and they didn't live well, up to Well, actually, I, I did a film. <laughs> 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 with Harrison Ford. <laughs> now, when I met him, he was very monosyllabic. He didn't speak. He yeah. Just... <laughs> but my lord, is it? You know, they're all the same in bed, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> so I thought, oh really? Oh God, you're boring. And then he hit on me. Oh. And I went. Ooh. Did he become but a less boring? But I didn't realise he was sitting on me. He said, "Do you fool around?" And I went, "I didn't know what he meant." <laughs> I don't know what do you mean. Said, oh, <laughs> really, to me, northern route. I don't know what you mean. He went, okay. <laughs> yeah, so that was so stupid, but I was hit on. Oh, well, wow. I think I was. I, I... <laughs> Shall I do? I did a film. Yeah, Go I did a film. Yeah, I on. did a film once. And uh, Ben Kingsley oh. was on it. Ooh. Yeah, and and I had really loved Gandhi. And when you meet him, he's really got like lights behind his eyes, like candles. If you oh. met him, Jack, yeah. they're literally like candles behind his eyes. But he couldn't have behaved less like Gandhi if he tried. Well, but he wasn't what Gandhi. Do you mean? He was Can't pretending say. to be Gandhi. No, you've got to say. <laughs> well, he was just. He was, was he like just... Captain Kirk? Um, tell us, tell us. No, well, he was just. He wasn't Gandhi-like. Well, really what do you mean? Grand. You mean he was rude? He's legendary for being grand. Well, there you go. You said it. I didn't. <laughs> and you, when I had dinner with Sir Ben Kingsley, <laughs> they were very nice to me. Oh, oh, well, that's <laughs> because he was scared of you. <laughs> I can't really match. I mean, I suppose for, for me, it's just meeting people on here. And I suppose for someone who was my idol and I met them on here, it wasn't that they were, they were disappointing in how they were. I was just very disappointed that... You know when you have in your head, you're going to meet someone who you've looked up to for years and years and years, yeah. and they will meet you and they will say, you are amazing, we're going to become best friends and they're going to hang out it? all the time. It, it was Clive James. Oh, oh. did he like and you? I, I love Clive James. I think he's really intelligent, amazing, him. amazing brain, all that. I love all his books and all his TV programmes. Couldn't be less interested. And I was really gutted. <laughs> Oh, really no. got it. Yeah. Did you pull out all the guns, full flow? No, I, to be fair, I did go a bit daft on Twitter, he says. Oh, to be okay. honest, I probably wouldn't have liked That's me if I'd met me that day. But, but there we are. You know, it oh. happens. Well, at least he met your gaze, which is more than I could say about uh, Matt Damon. <laughs> What's he doing, Del? What are you doing, Del? 